What's up guys, this is Michael coming at you again from Fairview Heights, Illinois. I am here at this abandoned home decor furniture and mattress store. Um, it closed because it relocated up that way. It's across from that shopping center where Hobby Lobby is, Home Goods, Fresh Time, Dick Sporting Goods. If you know where that's at, comment down below. But this location is abandoned, so I thought I'd check it out. So let's go check this place out. Here it is, abandoned home decor, furniture and mattress. There's the old sign there, completely covered up with paper. But hey, how do you guys like that parking? <laughs> I parked that. We don't judge the parking, okay? <laughs> All right. I smell food. I think it's the Hooters. Well, we are going to eat today. I think we're going to go eat at Steak and Shake. We can't eat the one. Eat at the one in Fairview, though. <laughs> It's hot on this window, like holy crap. You could see in there pretty good. An old home decor furniture. Yeah, like I said, this place didn't go out of business. It just relocated to a newer store. But this was a good sized store. I don't know why they closed. Nope. Here's another view on the inside. I'm trying not to put my face on the door on the window. It's hot. It's 72 degrees and the sun's like really shining here. Let's go walk to the back and check it out. Now, after this video, I will be filming two more places. Two more places. And then I'll be getting something to eat at Steak and Shake and then going home. The other abandoned place I'm going to do is an abandoned shoe carnival and an, an, a store tour of the Sears outlet. Today I've done three store tours. Three. The Johnny Max, which is closing, a tour of the entire St. Clair Square Mall, and the Sears outlet, which I'm saving to last. It was kind of good that the home decor store m moved because literally right across the street from it was a weekends only. I don't really like weekends only because they're just, they're only open in the weekends. Like, I just feel like a store should be open every day, except for Sunday. Sunday, a lot of businesses are not open. Let's see if the building, well, the building does have power. I'm being silly mattress here i bet you the homeless guy was here there's the toys r us that i filmed a long time ago i filmed that back in july or not july i can't remember what month it was it was way back then though it stinks There's nothing there but yeah guys i love toys r us it was such a good store i can't believe it's gone been gone for quite some time now yeah there's the mall over there you can see how good that's macy's yeah down there is the mall all right we got a door over here at receiving that we can try oh and guys i, for I forgot to mention this in my last three videos i'm sorry i haven't really uploaded a lot of videos lately because i had to deal with a lot of school work and plus i had to deal with a had to have a big project that i had to do in rhetoric which is my writing class for ninth grade <laughs> And that project was not easy at all. <laughs> like, it, it wasn't. It's locked. But yeah, it was not really that easy at all. Check this out. Nope. I just can't stop looking at the Toys R Us. I just cannot believe it's closed. You guys can see the cart returns are still there. It's sweet. <laughs> Oh man. Here's one more door we can try. Let's see. Nope. I think this is the end of the building here. Are these door are these doors part of the uh, home decor? I'm not sure. Let's go see. I think I think the rest of this here is the Vatterock College. We'll give this door a try though. The sprinkler room, maybe it leads somewhere. It's locked. <laughs> Let's see. Not a 
it's locked. All right, guys. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up. And I will see you guys once I film the abandoned shoe carnival. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Here's one more look at Toys R Us. Let me get away from the tree. <laughs> one more look at Toys R Us. This is probably the last time you will see this Toys R Us. Well, yeah, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.